Let me see if it's behind the screen. Excuse the background noise if you can hear that. It's raining quite heavily, so um, yes, excuse that. But today we're going to be talking about music in Doctor Who and what has happened to it over the past few years or so. Now, I feel like all of the Russell C. Davies era, the music was pretty darn good. Like there were sort of unique themes for each episode. It was sort of, it was different each week. It w it was cool and. Every series had that one big standout piece along with other pieces that were awesome to, to keep going along with it as well. So I say series one was probably the Doctor's theme, series two was probably the Doomsday theme, series three was probably Bo or the Gallifrey theme. Series four was probably the Song of Freedom. And then and then we get into the sort of Stephen Moffat era and I think the music for series five and six was sort of alright, like, I say the standout theme in Series 5 was obviously I Am The Doctor, and Series 6 didn't really have one, to be honest, thinking about it, and I think that's where the music started to take a dive, and ever since then there's been these standout pieces, these these pieces that are really good on their own, that don't have the little bits in the soundtrack to complement them with, like, one of my favourite soundtracks from recent years was Time Of The Doctor, I love the Time Of The Doctor soundtrack, there were amazing pieces in all of that all of that episode the the soundtrack was amazing all of the themes are amazing this is how it ends is my favorite i think that is a brilliant piece that just builds and builds and builds and builds love that soundtrack why can't murray gold do that for every episode because series nine they haven't put out a soundtrack release yet and honestly i don't blame them because the only pieces i can think of were clara's death music and the Heaven Sent theme, and even then, I couldn't hum along to those themes now. Whereas, if you said, I'll hum along to Bo, I could hum along to Bo like that, I could hum along to sort of pieces from from series one to four to a lesser extent, five. But after six, the pieces are just so forgettable, they seem to be like generic music, and when and when some someone's and when you're supposed to be sad, the music's just telling you to like, oh, you're supposed to be sad now. It's not really speaking anything out other than, oh, you're supposed to be sad now. It's not, it's not powerful anymore. And things like the Clara death theme should be memorable. So why can't I hum along to it now? I mean, I can even hum along to Amy and Rory's death scene. Da, 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 da. Now, I don't really blame Murray Gold for this particularly because he has been doing it for over 10 years now he's been doing this music since the show came back so i can understand if he's a bit tired of doing doctor who music i think series 10 he should be his last series or at least as a regular i think someone new should take over as a head of music when chipmore takes over because we need something new we need something fresh and the music just hasn't carried that through at all recently but there are these little pockets of greatness, like I said, this is how it ends, is amazing, and obviously A Good Man, A Good Man was probably the standout piece of Series 8 soundtrack, so that, Series 8 had a standout piece. Yeah, but Series 9, the music was just so forgettable, a lot of reuses, um, a lot of repeats in music that were composed for that series. A lot of music that was just filler music that you skip on the soundtrack. That's what a lot of it feels like as well. Music that you skip on the soundtrack. You know how you get soundtracks and you're like, mm, bit boring, I'm going to skip that. A lot of the music is beginning to sound a lot like that lately. So I'm not really an expert on British TV composers, but if any of you out there, who do you think should take over? Because I do think Murray Gold, it's, it's kind of time to pack it in a bit. It's really starting to get a bit stale now. But... There are pockets of greatness in there. Maybe oh, I don't, he should. He should definitely. This shouldn't be it for his composer with Doctor Who. This is what I believe. Chapman with Stephen Moffat now. I don't believe that when he leaves, he should never write an episode of Doctor Who again, like Russell T Davis did. I think he should come back every series to write one episode, and I think Murray Gold should come back every series to score an episode or score a couple of episodes, because. It's starting to get really stale when he's composing the whole series, and a lot of the music is just sort of like comedy music, like really wacky. Oh, look at us, we're being wacky. It's really 
just not pleasant to listen to. And it could be worse. We could have music that is just completely just white noise that fades into the background all the time. So, yes, it could be worse, but I really think music in Doctor Who at this point really should adopt the classic series route and have different people working on it, not just one man. Just how I think writing should adopt the classic series route, where not just one man is overseeing all the scripts, it's just this whole table of people bouncing ideas off each other. That's what it should be, that's what the music should be as well. So next week I'm away for the week, but uh, I am going to Cardiff to the Doctor Who experience again, but this time I'm going on a walking tour of the locations used since 2005, and also they've moved the Target book gallery museum thing from London and now some of it is, is in the Doctor Who experience so I'm really excited about that. I don't have plans to like properly vlog it but I will film some stuff and I will take loads of pictures so I will upload videos just sort of a photo montage so yeah I look forward to that I'm very excited to see all the different locations that have been used since 2005 so yes if you like this video please like subscribe comment and I'll see you in my next one. Take care now.